So this is the arch finished and ready for labelling up. Um, so we'll start straight away with um, the easy ones first. We see here this is called the rise. Here is where everything um, radiates from um, and this is called the striking point. So we have the striking point, not to be mistaken by here we have what we call the springing line because this is where the arch springs from. So this here is the springing line, springing line and here is the springing point. And the spring and line is always the same distance as the span. So we have the span there. Here the underside of the arch, we have the intrados. And on the outside, this edge here, we have the extrados. Uh, as we said earlier on, this third of the arch is called the haunch. So to the other side, and the top third is called the crown. Here we would have in the centre a key brick. Not always a key brick, sometimes it works to where we have a joint there. But where we do have a centre brick, that is called the key brick. And uh, just talking about the introdos as well, when you're actually looking at this, um, on like proper arch, this would be the soffit as well. So intrados when you're looking at it on a drawing, but when you're actually standing under an arch and looking up, this would be the soffit. So I will write that in there as well, soffit. As we said before, this is an axed arch where the axed arch, and you've got like four to six millimeter joints. This, we're two rings here, so although it's a rough arch, it's a two ring rough arch because we've got two on there. So, two ring rough arch. And as we said before, the joints from here, they sort of vary from, we'll say, 6mm to about 20mm. So, 6 to 20mm. Anything bigger than 20 starts to look really quite awful. And uh, this part here, where you see I've done like stretches there, still on the X arch, but here where we have um, the headers in there as well, this would then be called a bonded arch. Okay, so that's pretty much the terminology for a semicircular arch. And the next one we're going to do will be a segmental arch.